Hello and welcome to a further update on one of my Element RCs and the last time I featured on the channel I was showing how I'd fitted the IFS kit or the independent front suspension kit at the front there and the other thing I'd installed was the Element RC in a fender set. You can now see it has different wheels and a different front bumper on it and that's because it is now an Element RC Enduro Trail Runner Fire. Now here's a quick explanation for those of you who didn't see the previous video why this is now the Trail Runner Fire. When the first Trail Runner came out I really didn't like it because the body was white. However, I was really interested in the independent front suspension because my Element RC Enduro Sendero has the four-link suspension set up as did this Trail Truck Builders kit. So because I already had two Element RCs and I really didn't like the white body on the Trail Runner, I just forgot about it and moved on. But when they released the Trail Runner Fire, I really, really liked it. But again, I couldn't justify buying another Element RC. And that's why I opted to get the independent front suspension kit and fit it to this builder's kit version. Now at the time of doing that, the body I had on it was an Axial 1967 Chevy C10 pickup. However, I could never get it to sit right with the chrome bumpers, especially at the back. And then a couple of days ago, I'm just surfing through eBay and this body came up for sale. Now it's been taken off and ready to run, so it's a factory painted body and it's come with all the accessories. And the other thing that was included was the complete set of trail runner wheels. Now this body is available to buy separately, but it doesn't actually come with the wheels. Okay, so this is an update of the update that you've just been watching, which I recorded a few days ago. And since I recorded that, I've ordered the correct trail runner rock sliders and they've arrived and I've put them on. Now these were the rock sliders that were on it before and these are off an Element RC Enduro Sendero. But the correct trail runner rock sliders, they actually have a groove running along there so the body sits in the groove and that helps keep it nice and rigid. Okay, so there we have it, my Element RC Trail Runner Fire. All I've got to do now is fit a generic interior and a driver. But for now, I shall just give it a little run in the woods so we can see what it looks like on the trail. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon.